Okay, so, three orbs down, five to go. Uh, now we still haven't got, we've only got one key. We haven't got many things here, so I think we're pretty much, as well as pick up these knives now, I used to all throw them at the damn dragon. Okay. So we've been to Spires, we've been to Rain. Uh, hmm. Is there anywhere else for us to go? I don't think there is because we've been everywhere, haven't we? This is half the problem. I remember a lot of, about this game, but I just don't remember all of it. <laughs> and I remember it, it's very difficult to get to know what to do and when. Oh, this way, wasn't it? We, did, we went. Was it that way? No, we came from here, didn't we? We've been there. Let's see who's the up to that. Hmm. for that, didn't we? Mm, a fire tree. Ah, of course, we now have the way to get through the fire tree for the fire, don't we? That's where we have to go next. Well, that's we don't have to, we don't have to go there next, but we shall go there next. Fire extinguisher. Just turn to what's her name. Who? Dr. Bozuki was insistent that you should join him at the Temple of the Oracle as soon as possible. Okay. Well, in that case, we shall we shall go straight there then. I've reviewed the calculations of my formulas and I've managed to increase the potency of my wee potions. At no extra cost to your good self, I might add. I'll also do you a favour and swap your old files for new. Now, can I interest you in any of my more potent wares? Is this why you called us? Uh, exploding vials, gas cloud. A volatile. But have you come back for some of? Not a fortune. But enough to see my list. Is it because you're worried? Is that the only reason? Seriously, there's nothing else. Yep, that's pretty much it. Alright, fair enough. <laughs> Back to the fire tree. Yes, come, I have important news. Oh, no, no, I don't. <laughs> oh. 
Right. Whoa. Hmm. Ah. Nice rats. Save the game again. Tell me. Yes, yes. Can do six. Okay, don't pick it up then. <laughs> You know, Vivian, you could use that magic now. Oh, she's got enough spec mana, actually, because she's... That's, that's why she's not doing it. I'll put it at level two, didn't I? it back and there we go. Cool. Lightning staff, a bronze key, and some gold. Tell me. Of well, I just killed a big, giant rock monster thing that was impervious to magic. So there you go. Okay.
Ooh, chicken. Ah! Beans. Set the trap. If your path takes you to the monastery, turn back. You'll find nothing there but an asylum of psychotic madmen. And the monks? They are all demented. Our water supply was poisoned. By silver? That's my belief. We wouldn't bow down and renounce our ideology. We are strong, virtuous people, and he's punished us by stealing our peace and damning us to a life of anguish. You say we. Have you been affected by the poison? No. I was in rain during the infection and was spared the madness. But while my brothers suffer, I suffer. Rest assured, Oop, Silver will pay. But you can't live in the monastery without water. Where will you go? If your mission challenges Silver, then my place is with you. I am strong and proficient in the more traditional fighting arts. I would be a loyal ally. Hmm. What's all about Vivian? We would be honored. But first, how do we address you? By my given name, Kagan. Kagan. Vivian, go to the rebel camp in Haven and check if we've had word from the Duke. Wait there and rest until we need you. Hmm. Okay. Let's have a look at what we've got here. Wow, he's got an awful he's got a hell of a lot of health. I mean, okay, Doug's got the most health, but he's got he's got a lot of that but he's also very proficient in magic. So let's go on that. Mag let's do that. Uh, magic wise Give him that. And yeah, that should do. Oops. To the monastery. Huda. <laughs> Huda. You guys are just gonna stand there. Right? Life magic's upgraded, that was quick.
Yeah, there you go. Okay. Hey. Sadukan. It was Hadouken, isn't it? Not Sadukan. <laughs> Somewhere between a combination of Hadouku, Sadoku, and uh, <laughs> Street Fighter. Hadouken! for me. Scythe. Your kung fu skills are no match for my long sword. Ah, yes, there we go. I knew there's a way around. Now, the reason why I know this monster very well is the reason why I know this monster very well, I should say. It's because this is where one of the bugs used to be that caused so much grief. And that's going to be the moment of truth to see if they've actually fixed it. Who do it? Okay. Right. 
Now I can pick up the bread. Now basically this guy lets you travel in time to do something, but unfortunately it can, this is where the bug used to occur and you have to do this in order to progress the plot. You have to get a key to open up a windmill, which we haven't seen yet. Um, he appears to be unaffected by the poison. Could meditation counter its effect? It's more likely that he's remained in a trance throughout and hasn't drunk the infected water. Do you think he can hear us? If he chooses to. <clears throat> I don't mean to disturb you. But human nature is prone to inquisitiveness, I understand. <laughs> and no, I didn't drink the water. But unfortunately, I'm the only one here who didn't. And you have killed my brothers. Prepare to die! <laughs> you must leave the monastery. You won't survive long without water. I won't leave. I stay until the poison dissipates and the font is purified. Meditation will preserve me. Is there nothing we can do to change your mind? No, but it would help my concentration if you could find me one of life's great questions to ponder. I will reward your labor well. We'll do what we can. Thank you, but now I must return to my trance. Hmm. And that's pretty much all we can do with him right now. something about the library because the library had the greatest thing a life question yeah because I remember that from um oh hello you will have to forgive my excitement but uh uh, he's just reasoned out one of life's great questions. Oh, how useful. Yes, thank you, Professor. Here, you should take it. Such thought-provoking philosophies are inspiring. It may help you on your quest. Thank you. I'm sure it will. Yes, it will. Thank you. To the monastery. Excuse me, sorry. <laughs> Talk to him again now. Um. <clears throat> we have a scroll that details a life question for you to ponder. Thank you. 
I'm sure I'll find this most engaging. In return, take this ethereal potion. It will transport you to a different place in time and will answer questions you don't yet know to ask. So this is when you drink the potion, it goes everything that would go wrong. Fingers crossed. Yes. So this is from the introduction. Ooh. Nice guy. Now I can't tell you how many times that Algaladon worked. I was transported to a gallery where Reuben was exhibiting his paintings. Then Silver walked in. It was horrific. Reuben's boots and this key were all that were left. Your adventures have been many. I will record them in my book, so that you may know them always. Oh, I'm so glad it worked. <laughs> cool. So we have Reuben's key, but now we have to find how to get to Reuben's house. Ah. Uh. I don't know what that is. Uh, hmm. Oh, so, someone's basically explained that you have to have an enemy that is seeing in order to get those those uh, chests. But, uh, yeah, we'll find that. <laughs> hmm. Where's Reuben's house? Off to the right. I don't think we ever went up to the right. Out of it again. Oh. 
everything, isn't it? <laughs> that was weird. Magical stones, heal, healing stones, yes. Ah, this is Ruben's house. I remember now. If I go up here, it should be a water wheel. Oh, now we gotta go up there. Okay. Wasn't this Reuben's house? Yes, I used to come here as a boy and watch him paint. Silver will pay for his death. Alright. Nice hair. Who are you? And how did you get in? Sorry, we didn't know you were here. We used Ruben's key. That's impossible! Ruben's opening an art exhibition in the north. Were you a friend? Yes, my name is Charo. I'm also his student. You said were. Has something happened? I'm sorry. It seems Silver took offense to Ruben's subject matter. He killed him. What? I'm afraid he's right. We saw Reuben's death while using an ethereal potion. So why are you here? Come to rifle his work? You're upset. Please. We're not here to steal anything. We're looking for eight magical orbs. They'll help us defeat Silver. Why? Reuben was nothing to you. Silver is evil, and he will continue to kill indiscriminately until he is stopped. And we will stop him. Then I must help you. Oh boy, uh Well, let's talk about Jug for him, okay. Charo, you are a welcome ally. Jug, go back to the camp and wait for the Duke. He would want to learn of Reuben's death. Lightning magic orb. Charo, surely you knew that Reuben had this orb. Yes, but I just presumed it was one of his more abstract sculptures. Ha <laughs> 
sound of the video hoppers. <laughs> right, let's get out of here. Because I think there was a path down, wasn't there? Wait, I remember. There's, there's. First, I wonder if that key I got, because I remember I got that key. Um, because I remember going. If we went down, remember, to fight the ice giant, but we, oh, we couldn't go up because we, I, well, I didn't go up. But I know that up, up requires a key. I wonder if that's the key I've already got. magic that's so gonna be more effective Right. So we can go off to the right. Go up or up. Jaro waits there because he can hear something. It's a trap! Yeah. All right. 
actually good. Hammers. Yes, see, there we go. So there's the key. All the use for the key. You know where we are, don't you? Glasses Palace. Surely you're not considering going in. That's exactly what I'm considering. But are we ready? After all, Glass is Silver's daughter. And she's a very powerful sorceress who's probably using one or more of the orbs to enhance her power. If I have to, I'll go in alone. No, if we go in, we go in together. Mm -hmm. Sounds right, right to me. Tell me of your deeds, adventurer so that I may record them in my book of legends. Alright. Okay, next up, Glasses Palace.